Hey guys, it's Jack. Welcome back to the arcade. Let's get back to just another game. Paper Waluigi, the Thousand Year Door, where I have spent a bunch of time climbing the ranks back up to the major leagues. I am once again the number one contender. And I'm ready to challenge Rock Hawk for the title. He's kept it warm for me long enough. It's time to take it back. I want that sweet room. Well, hello there, Mr. Gonzalez. Ready for a fight, are you? Well, all right then. Let me just see here. Your next opponent will be... Current champion of the Glitz Pit, Rawcock! Pay attention. In this battle, I want you to use at least one special move, okay? You need to show my paying customers all the fancy ninja stuff you've been hiding. Now get in there and blow the roof off, all right? I think we can do that. Now, for those of you who are interested, I did record my run back to the top. Miss Gonzalez, it's time for the next match. Come with me in a minute. I'm talking to my audience. I did record my run back to the top. Honestly, not much changes. If anything, there is different dialogue for all the different stipulations that Miss Jolene gives you, but in essence, they're the same stipulations. You also have a different title. Instead of um, whatever Grubba called you, you are now the Superstar sequel, so... But, you know, there's some dialogue. I talked to the guys. They're all happy to see me back and fight, so... You know, there's a little bit of, of interesting things there. I'll put it, up, put it up as a... Maybe a no commentary bonus episode, just so people can see it if they want. Now for today's main event. After coming back to take the Major League's top rank, the Great Gonzalez will finally challenge the champion, Rawcock. First to make his appearance, we have the Feral Nuclear Reactor, Rawcock. Champ! Kick him! Well, champ, tell us about your mindset. After all, today's challenger is... The Great Gonzalez, the only man to ever wrestle the belt away from you. That's all ancient history. There's only one true champ, and that guy is Rockhawk. One of us is walking out of here with the belt, and the other one's getting rocked. But champ, Gonzalez showed no signs of rest in climbing back up the ranks. He shattered his own records one after another. How does that strike you? Hey, shut your trap or this Gonzalez won't be the only one filling the rock. I'm the champ. End of story. I'm a legend. And this legend is about to rock that dude. Big words from the champ. And now the challenger who needs no introduction. The former champ returns. The superstar sequel. The Great Gonzalez. Had to try to roll him again. Gonzalez! 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 Jumpman! Wait, who? Wow! Listen to those cheers! People are totally pumped up for this match, huh? Let's hit that ring! Let's do it! Rock on, man! Gonzalez! He's back! Damn right I am! Listen to the crowd! Give it up for the brave challenge of the great Gonzalez! It's been a while since these two met, but who will emerge victorious this time? The battle is ready to begin. Ring that bell. It's more like a gong than a bell. But we get to listen to Rock Hawk's sweet theme. Okay, Mario. We're finally finding the ch this chump again. Let's totally rock him. <laughs> Time for you to meet the new and improved Rock Hawk. Feel the horror of a world-class rocking. All right, do I need to tattle you again? Use a special move at least once, I'll do just that. Uh, doesn't look like it, but let's go ahead and start off things showing him our own power. Has any of your stats changed? That's Rockhawk. He flips, flaps, and slaps. That's what the book says. Max HP is 40, attack is 3, and defense is 1. Doesn't look like it. All right. Let's go. <laughs> of course, you take half your own damage rounded down, so this is gonna be fun. You give me my damn belt back. 
Why don't you go ahead and rally wink? We'll use that special move this turn. Let's see. Uh, let's go ahead and use power lift. Just to really rub it in. Plus, this is the stage where we got the gold star. Got a plus one, plus two. And that counters our special move. Attack is boosted. Defense is boosted. Yeah, he really is a fun opponent to fight. Out of everybody, I really enjoy dealing with him. He's got the best animations. And I couldn't see that was a mushroom because it was full of toads. And, you know, that sounds speciesist, but... It makes it really hard to see. I mean, I kind of wish this fight was harder. Just like, well, you've been improving, so has he, but no. Same stats, same moves. We're better, he's not. He can barely do any, be any damage to us. And actually, I can't get up there to you. Hmm. Oh, you know what? Let's amp the crowd then. You'll have to come down sometime. If I had hammer throw, this would be the time to use it, but I'm not using that badge right now. Oh, he can heal himself from up there. Alright, well, let's earth trimmer then. Maybe we can get up there. Also, why am I not, like, using Vivian? She can reach him. Duh. I just now thought of that. Alright, we'll switch to Vivian. Not quite. Tactics, Goombella, you're done. Or, I got a better idea. What about just going to Bobbery? Oh, that's a sweet new move. And of course, now you're down. That's okay. You haven't met Bobbery. You don't know what he's capable of. Bobbery, overkill. Meet Rockhawk. Give him the rock. And one star point, of course. No! I don't believe it. Am, am I actually going to get rocked again? You just did. Who could have seen this coming? You can plan a more ferocious battle. Wild moves, raw power, fists and fights, feathers of fury. What beautiful destruction. This was without a doubt, inarguably, definitely, absolutely, completely, an extreme battle of the very highest caliber. But there can only be one winner, and this time it was the great Gonzalez. Congratulations, Gonzalez. Once again, you're our champion. And we stay that way. Everybody loves us. Everybody wants to be us. My name's Mario. Congratulations, Gonzalez. I was a little worried that you were over the hill, but you made quite a comeback. You are, tr you are a true champion. You got a champ's belt. The champ's belt you earned when you beat Rockhawk. Now, I think I know what you're thinking. You plan to move on, don't you? Well, that's fine, of course. I'll keep you registered in case you ever wish to return. Come back and give the folks a thrill every now and then, you know? Defend your title. Of course, if you lose, you'll have to drop back down into the Major League. Well, then I'm rather busy as usual, so you'll have to excuse me. I need to work out a plan to bring Rockhawk back. That guy really draws crowds. Have a nice day, Gonzalez. So if you want to keep challenging Rockhog, I think he's always the number one contender and you can have as many rematches as you want. But in the meantime, we can actually use the champion's bed. Take a rest under our own smiling picture because we are the best. And that fills up our star power. 
finally we get to really exercise that effect. It is pretty inconvenient to keep coming back here just to sleep to refill your star power, but you know, we had that little mission outstanding, it's complete. And now we can move on to more important things, like greeting our public. Hello everybody! Yes, you all love me. You all love Mario. Hooray for the great Gonzalez of Valiant comeback and once again, once more Uranus Chan. If you're getting the belts, it's like a soup. What delicious ingredient are you? Meat. Just meat. Oh, hold up a sec, champ. Flash, flash. Okay, got it, huh? What's this? They're in the background. Looks like a guy in a green hat with a mustache. Is that... Is that a ghost? Oh, I ain't paid enough for stuff like this. Luigi? <laughs> are you following me now? Are you are you going to climb the ranks for your revenge? After, you know, I was pretty cruel to you last episode. Freelance cameraman here, Gonzalez, a revived champ. How about an exclusive? You brave fire and floods for the love of your life. Now that's a story. Yeah, we're not going to do that. What we are going to do is we are going to go ahead and take on a, a couple of troubles. Our last two troubles, I think we're going to do this episode. Next episode, I think we're going to go to the minigame corner. But I need to practice on that a little bit more. I don't think I'm going to be able to give you guys a good show, but at least I can try. So yeah, let's go back. We'll do the last two troubles. Next episode, we'll do the mini games. We'll head down the last shine sprites we have. We'll listen to the last of Grifty stories if there's time. Which there should be. And, uh, yeah. After that, I can't, other than recipes, I can't think of too much to do. So why don't I see you guys in Rogueport. So, because Rockhawk took so long, I really hadn't anticipated doing any recipes this episode, but it occurred to me that we do need one for one of the troubles we're about to take on, and I don't think I actually had it. So I managed to go to and get some ingredients real quick, and I think we can show off two or three simple recipes to add to our journal. Yes, please cook something up for me. I want you to cook a honey syrup and a cake mix to start with. Yep, do that. And this is going to be something that, diddly do that. this is going to be the item that we actually need for one of the troubles we're about to do. So this will save us a trip. And when I was doing this, it occurred to me that I hadn't done, like, I hadn't tried this recipe with maple candy or jam and jelly, so, or maple syrup or jam and jelly. So we might get candies out of that. All right, there's honey candy, replaces 20 FP. Yes, I would like you to cook something. I want you to cook maple syrup and cake mix. This might make a maple candy. I hope it does. This is kind of an experiment on my part. Doodly do da. Just going by the patterns that these things tend to have. And so far so good. Yeah, okay, looked like it came out perfect. Oh, we got a zest cookie, which is not what I wanted. Oh well. Um, I do know that this last recipe is one that we'll need. So we need a jam and jelly and a cake mix. Yep, cook it up. Doodly doo da. Got the hiccups. Bad time to have the hiccups when I'm on uh, on stream, on mic. Everything is stream, even when I'm not. Sorry to keep you waiting. Not sure I like it, but we got a jelly candy. Candy made by ZST replenishes 64 FP. All right, so that's at least two recipes we got to add. I think. Let's check the journal. Yeah. It's about two recipes. So we need 12 more. There are the candies. Alright, so 12 more. Not too bad. I'll probably do another five next episode. Oh, next episode. There might have to be an episode where I'm focused on recipes. I don't know. 
Maybe that I can get like six done in next episode and six done right before we go down to the door of a thousand. <laughs> the thousand year door. I got it confused with the pit of a hundred trials. What is wrong with me other than I smashed my toe today and it's been a very long day. Uh, all right. We're going to start with God. I can't speak. I've lost my voice because of the stupid stuffy code, ya boomski. I want someone to bring me some honey kennel, ya pal. Great for the threat I hear. I think you can make it by combining cake mix and honey syrup, ya chow. I'll be waiting next to the snowman at Far Outpost, ya blamo. Yep, we'll take it. We'll do it and do it right. Alright, before I go too far with this, I'm gonna put on... Oh, I got double pain. This is something I'm gonna experiment with. This doubles the damage Mario takes for zero BP. If return postage returns half the damage they do and I put on double pain, that might actually be a really deadly combination as long as I can keep myself, you know, alive. But uh, I'm gonna take off, I'm gonna take off return postage for now, put on bump attack, and I will see you guys in the far outpost. See you in a few minutes. All right, here we are. There is our customer. Yes. That's terrible. Don't worry about it. And give him the honey candy. I don't think it matters what you pick there. Ah, finally, I can speak your pal. I had been exploding so much that I completely lost voice, ya bluey. Thanks, ya crackety. Here is token of my appreciation, ya boom. You got 20 coins. You saw the trouble. Uh, probably still a loss if you bought straight up bought the cake mix. Definitely if you bought the cake mix and the honey syrup. But, you know, it's just a honey candy. So, I'll see you guys back in Rugport. We'll take on the last trouble. All right, let's go get our last trouble before, before chapter eight officially begins. Gold Bob, delivery please. I've been putting this off forever. I need you to take something to General White. Please come get it with all speed. Meet me in Poshley Heights. Wanna take it on? Yes. Do it and do it right. All right. So I think we, all pretty much understand what's going to be happening here. I think everyone understands why I've been waiting so long to do this. This trouble. This is just the game really kind of rubbing it in at this point. It really is. This is like Nintendo going, hey, you know that thing that you just did and you probably really hated? What if we made you do it again? Wouldn't you love that? Is Aren't we wacky people? Aren't we just a hoot of a game developer? And for those of us who have to make these videos and try to keep them around a half an hour, I can firmly say no. No, you are not. All right, let's go get it. Because guess what? Even though we just saw him, not like, five minutes ago maybe, in Far Outpost, General White is most assuredly not going to be there. Alright, hello Gold Bob. So Gonzalez, how did you enjoy your cannon ride, hmm? I'd like to go to the moon and look for some investment opportunities. But enough of that, I need you to take this to General White immediately. You got a package! I think General White is back in Far Outpost now, it's a bit far but you can handle it. All right, I'll see you guys there. Prepare for disappointment and rage. What a surprise, he's not here. Where did he go? Cannon will not be fired until the day we've been waiting for comes. Where is General White now? Let's go ask around. So I guess you can't get back to the moon at this point. I think you can in the post game. I had such a nice big explosion thanks to you, Chappelle. But I wanted to go to Moon too, Shakraki. I want to blow up a moon, Shadoom. 
Oh, good, good luck. Okay, there is somebody here. Huh? General Light. He left this morning with Pao. Da da. He uh, said he was going to see Cola Bartender at Rogueport or something. Of course he was. All right, back to Rogueport we go. Prepare for the video of a thousand clips. Oh, my poor editing fingers. All right, we're back in Rogueport. Place your bets. Podly, is he in here? Of course not. Hello, Podly. General White. Yeah, I spoke to him just a second ago, actually. We're old buddies, he and I. I've known him since he was a little sniper that would explode over any little thing. Then again, I was the kind of guy that would bonk people for smiling funny. Still, he turned out to be a, a fine bob though he has never cured that wanderlust, no doubt. I'm pretty sure he said he was off to Glitzville next. I go back pretty far with the guy that runs the juice out there, too. So I give him my best. Alright. I'm going to Glitzville. At least I don't have to come back up through the sewers to get there. This is just kind of a short jump. But not short enough, because I'm still going to cut it. See you guys in Glitzville. Alright, is he back in Glitzville? Let's check the juice shop. I'm betting no, but at least we got this out of the way early. I'm shocked. Shocked, I tell you. Well, not that shocked. General White, he pounded three white chocolate coconut mochas and bolted. He drops in every once in a while. Hey, and you know that lady in the black dress? I think General White has a thing for her, but that's just my gut talking there. She's darn cute after all. Guys come in more for her than for the juice, I think. Hey, and just between you and me, one of her admirers is Rockhawk. Oh, and now that I think of it, General White said he was going to Far Outpost soon. But first he had to meet Gold Bob, or not meet him, or something like that. Okay, maybe I don't go all over the world. That'd be nice. I will see you guys back at Poshley Heights. Ticket. This t Good thing this ticket is for like unlimited uses at this point. See you in a few. I see a gold bob, I see a Sylvia, I see a, a bob, I see no General White. Ah, Gonzalez, General White was just here a moment ago. But you had the thing I wanted to give him. What a rotten bit of luck. He said he was headed back to Far Outpost. That General White is a fine bob but he does tend to wander. And once he's asleep, it's near impossible to wake him up, don't you know? I told him to stay out and awake, so get over to Far Outpost. Sorry about that. Oh boy! Alright, well that was a real quick trip. And it doesn't feel like we went to as many places, so there's that. Maybe maybe they had mercy on us, I don't know. But I, what I do know is I will see you at Far Outpost. Alright, back in Far Outpost, let's go check his house because I bet he didn't stay out and about like he was supposed to. He's probably all warm and cozy in bed, aren't you? Yup. General White said he would sleep when he returned Pow, and he still sleeps Ka Wakao. You're about to watch something really satisfying. Seems to sleep, wake him up, yes. Nice, good. Still asleep, nice, good. Still asleep, nice, good. Definitely still asleep. Yes. Nice. Good. Still some logs. Yes. Nice. Good. He can be more sleep. Nice. Good. Counting sheet. Nice. Good. He woke. No. Still asleep. Nice. Good. Sleeping like a stashed baby. Nice. Good. Not even budging. Nice. Good. Still snoring away. Nice, good. You snarf, snarf, snarf. And he always does like a five flip wake up. Uh, hello, Mario. Do you need something? Take this package. Huh? What? A delivery from Gold Bob? You came all that way to bring it to me. Oh, thank you for that. I'll take it off your hands. There you go. 
Ah, yes, well delivered. So you'll go fetch a reward, I assume. Say hello to Golden Bob when you see him. Well then, perhaps I'll go check on my cannon. All right. One more cut, and I will see you guys in Poshley Heights. Yay! You stay put! Alright, I have made your delivery. This better be worth it. Did you find General White? I see, and he received it? Good, thanks, Gonzalez. Here is your reward. You got 64 coins. You solved the trouble. Have you been giving it your all, my boy? So we got some money. And that is the last trouble before post-game. So next time, as I said, we'll probably be doing mini games and hunting down the shine sprites I haven't found. So I'll see you then. Thanks for coming out and joining me today. As always, I appreciate it. If you enjoyed what you saw, let me know. Give me a like, leave me comments. Remember to subscribe. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Right now, I have to go edit. Y'all have a great day. Goodbye.